Well everyone, uh, we have made a lot of progress here. Uh, these are got fridge in the corner <coughs> for our drinks and our fibre broadband. Uh, tile the wall, we put in a few units to um, store stuff and install the sink because anyone who has a Neo will know that you need one. And <coughs> this is the um, command control here. Still very untidy, it's all work in progress still. And uh, all those cables got to be pulled back and tidied up. As you can see we got um, plenty of network points, four there, another four there. We've got a stack along the wall down the bottom here. And um, all along the back walls, right across the whole room. And there's the Neo standing proud. It only got moved down here a couple of days ago. And um, it's working brilliantly. The laptop that I use, nothing special, not very powerful. Does the job. And this is what I use for recording um, the printing. People like to see that sometimes. And there's the camera sat on top of the printer. A sublimation printer for doing things like um, mugs mainly and plaques and things like that. That's a Rico, uh, quite an old one. It's a GX7000, but it does A3. And um, we use a mug oven. <coughs> we can get about five mugs in there at one time and uh, cook them all at the same time. And then uh, what else have we got over here? Well, that's the 7.1 surround sound with HDMI, which is um, being installed. Lots of cables and pipes going up to the upstairs. And then we've got our LED lighting, got four three meter tracks, and that's the projector. Be handy for training that, rather than being squashed in our old conservatory now. I'll be able to um, project what's going on here and any of the videos I've made onto a big screen. This is our um, pre-treatment machine. It's new to us, it came on eBay and um, the price was good so although I didn't have the money I just couldn't resist it so we've hardly used it. I think I've treated about two shirts on it and I've got to get it dialed up correctly um, but it certainly is quick. Anyone who's got one will know how useful they are. came with platens as well, there's one in there <coughs> as you can probably see couple more platens down there. It's on a trolley so we can move it around. And our pre-treat and cleaning solution there. Heat press. And this is the baby that's been very busy lately. This is the sequin machine. And Angie's really been using this lately to produce some uh, some nice uh, transfers, sequin transfers. The embroidery machine tucked away in the corner. That will be coming into use at some point. And then here we have some of the designs that Angie's done. You can see they're attached to my um, video projector screen at present. And uh, I don't know whether you can get the sparkle coming from those, but they are quite, quite sparkly. And everyone comments on them when they see them. <coughs> And then down over in the corner, Angie's little desk from school, <laughs> heat press, and that's John stood in the corner as well. He's, um, he's wearing a shirt that Angie did recently for a show that's coming to our local city. And then here we've got all the sequin wheels, there's quite a lot of them. Uh, all different colours, all different um, sizes, and uh, they're all very useful, of course. And then over here, 
We had to have all new gas mains put in. Of course, the place had to be rewired. Most of that I've done myself. Uh, that little thing over there in the window is we've got fibre down here. And I transmit the connection up to the, um, the house, which is just four doors up. So I only need a connection in one place. And um, I connect to this one through another unit, the same as that placed in the window up the house so I can use fibre up the house as well so I don't have to pay for two broadbands telephone of course and back to the fridge so there you have it that's about it that's where we're at hell of a lot more to do spent an awful lot of money uh, doing it but you know we're getting there that's the main thing and we're enjoying it I don't know whether you can see those sparkling now but um, they really are sparkling to me anyway so there you go, that's where we're at. More to follow.